Tonight, a two investigation. Strange bills, security cameras, and lawsuits. Out of all places, the Algonquin Township Highway Department. The new commissioner tells to investigator Brad Edwards that his predecessor was wasting taxpayer money. The new guy, Andrew Gosser, with a Darth Vader coffee mug and a holy Bible at his desk. We beat him, and this is why, because there's just so much waste. For decades, the Algonquin Township Highway Department was run by Bob Miller's family. Miller himself was commissioner for 24 years, until he lost in a stunner last year to Gosser, who now runs the little-known district, responsible for maintaining a mere 67 miles of roads. And yet, we've got two Kubotas. Many townships would kill just to have one six-wheeler. We've got two. This is the world's state-of-the-art chipper. We have our own semi. If you like streamrollers, we've got three of them. After I was elected, I said, please don't buy the street sweeper. It's a $298,000 purchase that we didn't need. Gosser says right before Robert Miller left office, he did three things. Bought this sweeper with taxpayer money, unionized the workforce, and you say he had the computers wiped before his successor took office. That's correct. I think that it's indicia of a person who is concerned about having his documents discovered. Rob Hanlon is Gosser's attorney. So far, he's been paid more than a hundred grand to fight the unionization. He also brought suit against former Commissioner Miller for allegedly misspending taxpayer funds on, for example, family members' airfare to New Orleans. Sweaters and other women's clothing from Land's End, Levenger tote bags, even $182 on two Disneyland tickets. We went looking for Mr. Miller, who lives at the corner of Miller and Miller. He wouldn't talk to us, nor would his attorney. Gosser is also suing township clerk Karen Lukasik for allegedly stonewalling his attempts to get records. He claims you've destroyed records. That's absolutely a lie. This is her first interview. Her office is now under her own surveillance after she says she discovered she was being spied on. We're supposed to be serving the people, and he's not serving the people. He's serving himself. You get emotional. I don't know many people that would stick it out, but I'm, I'm, I'm not going to quit. I'm not going to quit. And Road Commissioner Gosser says he wasn't responsible for the spy cameras. McHenry County State's Attorney Patrick Canelli says he's investigating the claims against former road commissioner Miller, but he declined to elaborate. Robin Erica. These computers that have been wiped, mm -hmm. have they been able to do anything to get that data back? Yeah, now the new road commissioner has spent several more thousands of dollars to try to get a forensic analysis of what was likely wiped out, uh, almost trying to unwipe it and, and see it. So, a lot of wiping. Yeah, <laughs> apparently so. Yeah, thanks.